NDSU students are putting their game faces on and have their eyes glued to the screen in intense battles. The playing field? The video game Super Smash Brothers. They're playing two different versions of the game, Brawl and the latest edition, Ultimate. This tournament welcomes all kinds of players, ranging from those who have played for a long time no. to those who haven't had much experience with the game, like NDSU student Jacob Nelson. I'm doing it. I'm doing it too. I've been playing Smash like since Ultimate came out, so I'm relatively new, about like three months or so. Nelson says he didn't have the best experience with the game at first, but it got much better as it went on. It took me like a couple of days later when we were playing to finally like win a match and it was like the best thing ever because I like finally beat someone and I, I wasn't just going to be constantly beat all the time and then yeah that was, that was cool. Tournament organizers say they are glad about the turnout because of the game's popularity and high student demand. It's kind of hard to tell if you're going to have 100 people show up or 30 people show up. It really depends on different factors but it's a nice night and students are here having fun and they get to casually play without any time constraints, so that's really the best thing we can ask for. I'm glad I didn't get blanked that one time at least. Students say video game tournaments like these are great for building friendships and bonds because they know when it comes to a competition, it's anyone's. Yeah. The winner of the tournament